everyone Belinda here from Horror Tree back again with another dose of my Horror Tree weekly wrap up now before I get started I have to say it's the 1st of November here in Australia where I'm filming but I'm almost certain it is still Halloween in other parts of the world so happy Halloween guys I hope you had an amazing amazing night amazing day trick-or-treated got lots of trick-or-treaters went to a party just hung out just enjoyed the day whatever you did i hope you had a fantastic one i had a good one relatively low key um the two pups went nuts every time someone approached the house so i had to spend time inside with them so i didn't get to see as many costumes as, as i would have liked to because my area does get a lot of trick-or-treaters so hopefully next year i will be able to i'll have to sort something out with with the dogs but anyway it was still good fun and they still had a really really good time so so let's get stuck right into the calls that are currently up on the Horror Tree website. So first up, we have Crimin Ollie. So that's C-R-I-M-I-N-O-L-L-Y, Trash Tales. Now, the genre for this is trashy stories such as westerns, army, cheesy horror science fiction, etc. This one's detail so please jump on the horror tree website if the theme has grabbed you and they are after stories of up to 5,000 words max any genre as long as it has that trashy element to it the payment for this is profits are donated to uk and us liter literary charities the profits are donated to uk and us charities and the submissions close on the 31st of December this year. Next up is Wolf Singer Publications, Spirit of the Wolf. Now, the theme for this is the wolf has been a creature of mythology and legend since humans first told stories. Feared and, revealed, feared and reviled or worshipped and loved. The wolf symbolizes wildness and power in spirit of the wolf where they are hoping to capture the wolf in new stories that celebrate their wildness their freedom their magic and the mystic nature of the wolf themselves now they are looking for well-constructed speculative fiction stories where the wolves play a major role the only thing they don't want you to do is make your wolf evil they don't want that but apart from that they want all genres now they are after stories of between 2500 to 7500 words originals only if you do have a reprint that you'd like to submit query first and payment will be $20 and proceeds from sales will be donated to Mission Wolf. Now, the admission, the, sorry, the submission window opens on the 1st of November and closes on the 31st of March next year. Okay, next up is the Slab Press, Hiding Under the Leaves Folk Horror Anthology. So I'll say that again. So the Slab Press, Hiding Under the Leaves, a Folk Horror Anthology. Now, the theme for this is the anthology, which is titled Hiding Under the Leaves and is set to be published in November 2025, will be an anthology of folk horror short stories. Think curses and cunning folk. Think superstitions and the old ways. Think twisted rural landscapes and dark creeping woodlands. Now, payment, sorry, they are after 2,000 to 9,000 words. They pay one pound per word with a maximum of 50 pounds. And the submissions open on the 9th of February next year, so plenty of time to work on a story, and close on the 23rd of February next year. So only a very small submission window. And last but not least is Parsec Inc. Dark Hearts, the 22nd Annual Triangulation Anthology. Now, the theme for this is Dark Hearts is a women-centered theme for which anyone can submit stories. The anthology will feature speculative stories and poems about women who are anti-heroes. They want you to send them your story about shady ladies, women 
women and female presenting characters breaking the rules, defying social norms and getting up to no good. They are after genres of science fiction, fantasy and horror and they really enjoy an intelligent blend of all three. Now, stories and poetry outside these genres will not be considered, so don't even send them in. Now, they are after stories of up to 5,000 words, poetry under 100 lines, reprints or multiple subs. No, don't want either of them. Now, the submissions open on the 1st of November and they close on the 31st of January next year. And that's it, guys. Another awesome week of amazing submission calls by amazing publishers. And hopefully there's something in there I've spoken about that has grabbed you today. And if there is, of course, all the information you need is up on the Horror Tree website. Get on there and check it out. And if you are going to submit to anything, all the absolute best of luck to you. And as always, if you're watching these videos, if you're enjoying them, please hit like, hit subscribe, hit share, hit comment. Send us an email, send us some feedback. We love hearing from you guys. So please, let us hear you. And until next time, guys, thank you for watching. As always, you are amazing rock stars. And again, happy Halloween. And until next time, guys, stay safe, stay cool, stay spooky. See you later.